Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to show you how to upload a file in OneDrive. I'm going to uh, take you to step from 1 through 5, okay? So once you get my syllabus, I will send you the syllabus here. Uh, you want to go to this page here and this will get you started. So let's just for example, uh, just for week 1, because first day you don't do too much. You just click on this video here and, and that's about it. But once you get to week 1, uh, once you see that blue link there, I want you to hit the control key on your keypad until it turns into a finger like that. You see that? You just hoover around there. Make sure you click out first. Put your insertion point there and then hit con con uh, control. Then once you do that, hold it, left click, and it'll take you to this page here. And It'll take you now. What you hit is left click and just download that file. Okay. Once you do that, you want to go sign in into your office. Once you're in your office, uh, 365, you want to go to the grid right here. Okay. The app launcher. Mm -hmm. Or you could go over here to OneDrive right here. So either way, you just go over here, go to OneDrive. And here you can just right click new folder and just put student and you want to create it. Once it's created, you just click on it once. You're inside and you want to go up here to upload. Go to files and you want to look for the file that you had uh, uh, downloaded. Now you could change this. Oops, let me take that out. Just say you you see this, you want to change this part right here into details, okay? And you want to hit type. And once you hit type, you'll see the Microsoft Word document here. And the date is the time I uploaded it or it was made. So what you want to do is make sure this is the one you're looking for. And it matches on week, week one, okay? The week one is a cover letter demo. Okay, so what I'm going to do is click on that and open, and it's going to upload under students. Okay, so you just hit the upload and go to files, um, hit that part right there, the type, scroll around Microsoft Word document, and make sure it's on for cover letter demo. Okay, I probably want to, probably going to change the name to week one or something, make it easier. Um, but it's, I think it's too late for that because I've already uploaded the media file. So, and once you upload it, just click on it one time, left click it, and there you go. Okay, and what you do is keep that open. Actually, better yet, you go back to the syllabus and do the same thing for uh, step three. Step two is the, tu is the tutorial that I'm doing right now. So, step three, uh, we're at week one. We're gonna you want to hit um, hit hold down control button and then left click and it's gonna take you there okay and this video will walk you to it okay and I advise you to take this left click hold the button and drag it and so while you do this video you're gonna have this as well so you're able to do this and follow follow this okay okay and if you're done once you're done just pretend this is done you wanna uh, email it to me see step four you email the finished product to me make sure you finish it right right after you going through the video and following the video and you finished it you wanna go to save as save as you want to go to your student folder that you just made save it there and then just let's just name it something different uh, just say week one finished alright save that and that's because it's week one right here alright now you want to go back to your OneDrive again
go to your student now week one's right there just click on that and what you want to do is share it all right now sometimes I may not get your email through you know Microsoft 365 they just seem like they have a problem with their email so I advise you to just download the file if you can just download this and hit download once you download it um, just say you go to your email here just say my, my email is uh, gmail.com and all your files are downloads under the download thing okay and what you do is you compose and you just put my email all right and just put the subject put your name and just write what you've done but you want to go under attachment okay Yahoo and MSN will have something that looks like a clip okay they're all universal so what you do you left click on that and you go to downloads and find your file you gotta find it you could either do it by type or by date but sometimes the date is not accurate um, so you go by type and just remember what you downloaded you gotta remember the name okay it's week one finish hit open there you go all right and that and what you do is just send it and I'll get the file and I'll grade it and that's about it and after you're done you want to go back here after you email it to me you go to step five and you follow week one you want to take the quiz so you want to hold control button like that left click and it'll take you to the quiz and what you do um, I gotta hit that you gotta make sure you read this okay this is unlimited retake okay so you got to score between 90 200 and the reason for this I really want you to learn this material okay um, in order to take the test you take uh, you just put your email address okay now it's, at times I usually have this timed but there's times I'm not gonna time it because uh, I kind of run out of credits so I have I have a certain amount of credits here so let's go to timer proctor I don't think you have this feature but I could only do it but I only got 31 to 50 alright so I don't have very much I may have like 60 students or or 70 students in the future I may have to purchase credits. so what I'm trying to say is just I'm it may or may not be timed okay I usually time it for one hour but go ahead and just put your email, take the test. If you fail it, take it again until you make uh, 90. I'm not taking B's or C's. I want A's, okay? So good luck. All right, bye-bye.